Hey everyone, it's Nina. We are doing the Hollywood sleeves back at it, so let's get to it. Little Blue Ivy Carter got about $2 million in gifts, you know, just for being born. Because, I mean, that's what you do when you have a baby, you get gifts. Well, Beyonce and Jay-Z are definitely not needing any gifts. So they're taking all the gifts that they were given and they are donating them to young mothers in need. Which is a great thing to do, because let's face it, they can buy the best of the best. They don't need the gifts, so they're given back. They have tons of toys and books given out to local charities and stuff like that to help out those mothers in need, and they're doing a great thing. A source says they already have the most precious gift, so they want to give back to those who may not have as much as they have. But there is one thing on the list that they are willing to keep. You know, it's only a uh, $20,000 diamond-encrusted baby pacifier. The pacifier was given to them by one of their music industry friends, a very close friend at that, and they're keeping it so it can be baby Blue Ivy Carter's first piece of bling. Lucky child! I am seriously so jealous of this kid, but seriously, good job for the parents. Rihanna is a party girl, we all know that, but she may be partying too hard. After her record label saw pictures of her online smoking illegal drugs, well, they have persuaded her to check herself into a drug rehab, so that might be happening. Last week, while she was vacationing in Hawaii, she tweeted out, Kush rolled glass full, I prefer the better things. Doctors told Rihanna that she should stop smoking and drinking, but unfortunately, it doesn't look like she took their advice. Drugs are bad, Rihanna. Plus, people don't want to see that. Come on. It seems Adele is feeling a lot better. She is ready to perform. She is going to perform at the Brit Awards February 21st, and she's already booked for that. But the thing I'm wondering is, hey, are you going to perform at the Grammys? The Grammys are going on February 12th. No word enough she's willing to perform for the Grammys, which do come first, but she has said that she is ready to perform for the Brit Awards. She did tweet out that she was excited for the Grammys, but that's probably because she is up for six Grammy Awards. I mean, who wouldn't be excited? But you know what? She should show the Grammys some love. Come on, perform for us. If she's feeling better, the least she could do is perform for us, please. This has been your Hollywood Sleeves for today and more. Go to my website, ninablanco3.wordpress.com. That'll take you to the blog. You can check out all the other stories and fun stuff like that. And follow me on Twitter. I post them up there as well. Nina double underscore Blanco. And hey, subscribe to the YouTube page. You'll be the first one to know and first one to see all the videos. So I'll see you later. Bye.